Hi, Big Tractor Power fans. This video comes to you from a Western Kentucky cornfield where three Class 9 Case IH 9250 Exoflow combines are harvesting the crop equipped with 16 row 30 inch Case IH 4416 corn heads. During this video, I would like to take viewers out in the field so that you can see and hear these machines at work. But first, I'd like to give you some general information on the 9250 Combine. It's manufactured in Grand Island, Nebraska. It's a Class 9 machine based on its horsepower rating of 550. The Combine is equipped with a CVT 30-inch diameter rotor for threshing. The combine is fitted with a 410 bushel grain tank and is rated to harvest corn up to 5,000 bushels an hour. It's equipped with a 28.9 foot unloading auger that unloads at a rate of 4.5 bushels per second. According to CaseIH.com, the list price for a 9250 Axle Flow combine is $703,759. The 4416 Cornhead is listed at $159,237. Now that you know a little bit more about the 9250, let's climb up in the cab and visit with the operator and talk with him about operating such a large machine to harvest corn. Thank you for the ride. It's always no, impressive no uh, seeing these machines at work. No problem. I have four today. So the, the farm has been running 9240s uh, for several years and yes. jumping up to the 9250 this year. Is there a noticeable difference uh, between a 40 and a 50? Or? Uh, not really noticeable. The uh, major advantage we see is the full automation they have on these machines, uh, made the quality of the crop and uh, the throughput of the machine has increased it tremendously, uh, made a better crop going into the bin. What type of uh, capacity does this machine have? I see we're running at about two and a half miles per hour, just a little under three. Yeah, it depends on uh, your bushel per acre, you know, the, the uh, elevator capacity on this machine is about 5,000 bushel an hour, so um, I see on this one we're running about 3,500 right now. Uh, depends how green, how tough the crop is, and the bushel per acre is coming through, it's how fast I really like this hybrid. the ground speed is that we can run. Also, you've got to have the capacity to be able to haul it away in order to make it to 130 bushel an acre. That's Modern truck load going out the gate. That is, especially with uh, three 16 row machines. That is correct, yeah. We Everything's got to kind of be balanced and flow together. I mean, this machine probably, I'm around two and a half, three mile an hour, probably run faster, but uh, everything's got to flow nice and even. Uh, we can take a look out the front window here and see the other two combines, and they're on loading on the go. One of the things uh, the farm does is you're trying to do a lot more controlled traffic and, and strip tills, so you're, everything's kind of going 40 feet, 16 row planters, 16 row strip till, yeah. 16 row corn head. That is correct, yeah. Uh, there's a lot of advantage to that. I mean, everything's staying on the controlled traffic, you're keeping that compaction. All those multiple trips we're making, you're keeping that compaction in one spot. And uh, being on 40 foot heads, a lot pretty good size width that allows the crop that you're growing whether it be corn wheat soybeans uh, stay out of them compaction zones and uh, the yield is significantly higher in those areas it'll make up for the uh, compaction tracks you'll see they'll be reduced a little bit sometimes uh, possibly but uh, the areas that uh, you're staying off of are by far making up for it in yield 
these combines are equipped with tracks and you have quad tracks out here track Kinsey carts yeah, yeah. do that tracks on the combines uh, that's something you've been running for several years going back to the 9120s and 9230s yeah, that's exactly right yeah we have been and that's that's a major component of that uh, system there is to run that track uh, pounds per square inch on a track versus a tire is uh, tracks are just a fraction of what a tire is on that compaction zone see here when the uh, 410 bushel grain tank fills up that the amber beacon here starts to flash and that alerts the grain cart operator that it's time to unload and we can see the auger swinging out here.
I hope you've enjoyed spending some time out in the field seeing and hearing these three Case IH 9250 Axle Flow Combines harvesting corn 16 rows at a time. I'd like to hear in the comment section below this video what type of combine you operate on your farm and the crops that you harvest with it. If you've enjoyed this video, consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube where there's over 2,000 videos of farm machines in action. If you would like to see more corn harvesting content from this channel, continue to watch for a few more seconds to the end screen for a direct link to more Big Tractor Power YouTube videos. As always, thank you for watching.